the management of technology program at Tandang is uh, unique in a way that it is at the forefront of educating technology management leaders that culminates into a capstone project. We solicit projects from various sponsors, ranging from the public sector to the private sector. For the public sector, we can engage with sponsors like government agencies. For the private sector, we can engage with sponsors in companies ranging from manufacturing to healthcare to finance to transportation. And so the range of uh, company sponsors that we work with is, is quite diverse. So for example, I work with a lot of smaller social impact uh, non-profit companies. And at the other end of that is Jacobs Engineering, who are a large multinational. I believe it's because they're combining management innovation and technology, as opposed to other programs I've worked with where it's data science trying to prove a hypothesis. This marries organizational needs and skills. My Capstone project was a joint venture between a uh, engineering firm and the Department of Design and Construction of New York City. And what we were trying to find is how the current data that we have about the city and its utilities and how the current state of it is causing disruptions to the life that all around us. This semester I'm working with three separate groups of students, each of whom are investigating future business models for generative AI and large language models. For example, this could include ChatGPT or DALI, therefore being working with language or with images. So I sponsor uh, this project, it's called Meraki Bread. Uh, Meraki Bread is a uh, bread that uses spam grain to have develop a high protein, high fiber bread. At the beginning, it was a little bit hard for us to tell them what to do because we wanted to understand the market, but we also wanted to understand what was like the customer insights. And it was really interesting like we have one person that was like in packaging design. So they have like really interesting background and they help us even like think about what size of the packaging, where should we sell it, uh, who should we like partner with. So it was like a really deep research that they did for us. What we insist on is that the capstone is not just an assignment given by a company that they just have to implement. It is actually a project that they also co develop, even co-design uh, with the organization, and that's part of what they bring to the table. Our industry sponsors were a key element of our capstone development because they were our end users in the end, so having their constant feedback was key to making our project useful. We would have meetings with them weekly where they would orient us and connect us with other subject matter experts to really bring this project to its fullest. Their feedback and their perspectives were key to making sure that what we developed was actually going to be useful. Usually the feedback we have from the organizations is that just the chance for them to interact with these students students who are international, have a variety of perspectives, raise questions, makes them realize, even it makes me realize that, hey, you know, we haven't really thought this through as much as they actually are able to. So increasingly, I see that the organizations we work with are truly, I think, impressed, right? That's what I hear from the organizations because they see a level of quality that they haven't seen among students in general or people who are not even uh, uh, entry-level positions at all. They're really beyond that already. So if you, as an organization, have research needs or you have something that you don't have the resources internally or the funds to hire somebody to explore things for you, a capstone program is ideal. You get something of value to you, the corporation, and you've worked with students giving them some real hands-on experience that will be very valuable for them when they start working after graduation.